Hi my friends, today we model this part with the name center piece and I want you to know that this piece was created for scholastic purpose because this uh, chamfer is very difficult to obtain with the traditional tools on traditional machines. The drawing is this one with all dimensions I hope. Let's start standard millimeters 2 the sketch uh, this plane with X to the right then I create a rectangle in two point center dimensions are 100 tab 65 finish sketch these dimensions are here 165 and the extrusion is 25 extrude 25 okay now you have to be careful with this uh, cylindrical feature uh, the diameter of this circle is not present here. Why? Because it contains that circle, contains this point, and this point comes from this feature. From this feature, yes? This is why I have to consider 10 degrees, 35, 45, and uh, extrusion of 43 minus 25 let's do this sketch on this face line to here and here 45 35 is this dimension 35 10 degrees is this angle This distance is 45 divided by 2. Finish extrusion of this area at uh, 43 minus 25. Good. Only now we can draw the circle from this point as the center to this point at the radius the depth is 4 millimeters you see here of the circle finish sketch extrude cut on 4 millimeters okay now we apply mirror of this feature which is this about the XY plane we can select XY plane from here or from here okay then we see this uh, other extrusion at a distance of 6. I ignore this uh, chamfer and I apply extrude of this face on 6 millimeters. Okay, now we can apply the chamfer of 6. Good. Next is this slot. 
dimension 37 from the center, radius 8. Okay, we select this face, not this face, for a new sketch, and we use slot center to center. This is one center, 37 is this dimension, and uh, then 8 multiplied by 2. Finish sketch, extrude. Uh, this area with cut all the way okay you see the result another cut is uh, this one you see 35 on 10 is this cut 35 on 10 this is the face, rectangle, thirty-five, tab ten, and we place the midpoint of this button side over the center point or projection of the center point. Finish sketch extrude cut all the way through the part as you can see now here is a slot with two holes this uh, detail C is here dimensions 17 radius 4 distance of 6 of the axis from here and 8 this point the holes are 4 1 2 3 4 of 4 millimeters and the depth of the slot is 2 millimeters let's do this face sketch slot center to center I start from here, I hover to have the parallel and 17. Then 4 multiplied by 2. The distance between the axis and this edge is 6. On horizontal, the distance is 8. Finish sketch, extrude this, cut 2 millimeters. Okay, now the holes face, go back, hole this and this diameter of four through through all okay mirror mirror of the holes mirror of the slot the plane is uh, xy you see here what happens okay and now as you can see here all fillets are radius 6 where are fillets on the bottom and here yes no other fillets good I select this for applying fillet 6 is the value also here also and also I turn the part and I add this 2 ok this is the part my friends let's see 
What is the volume? I properties physical update copy close drawing double click and the new value is absolutely identical with the original good we go to the part we apply material of uh, steel carbon and we select view not default IBL but default lights and we have the part comparison is here nothing different that's all for today thanks for watching bye bye